go out and build a big business and then tell everybody about it. Today we're talking about my experiences with Grant Cardone. I first met with Grant three years ago at 20 years old, had a few takeaways then and a few takeaways just last month when I met with him. Welcome back to the channel, my name's Cody and today we're talking about my experiences with Grant, the man, the myth, and the legend. He owns a lot of apartments. I think he's up to five or six billion dollars worth of assets under management and a ton of experience under his belt. I first met with him, I was 20 years old, and that's about three years ago now, but I had a few key takeaways then that helped me get to where I'm at today. I got to do a little bit of one-on-one -on -one conversation with him at a very exclusive event. Yes, it cost a lot of money, however, it was well worth it. Back then, he said where I was gonna have difficulty scaling was scaling the seller financing business. However, at the same time, he said, look at what I did, not what I say. And so I took what he told me with a grain of salt and I looked at what he did as his business and his thing was go out and build a big business and then tell everybody about it. And so my thought process was, oh, I need to start telling more owners about what I'm doing. And a byproduct of that, I started really building out the YouTube channel. Chris and I ended up partnering. We really started to scale. And he told me I was gonna have difficulty scaling, but I took what he told me and what he really did over the past 30 years in his business and was able to more than quadruple my business. I went from 24 apartments at the time to now 110, about to be 122 in a week and a half and a resort. My biggest takeaway from him, look at what I did, not what I say. And that was at a small little conference where he was telling everyone else to put money into his fund and to join partnership and what he didn't do was throw all his money into a fund and, and partner with a bunch of people in the beginning. He went out, figured out how to buy a bunch of real estate and tell a whole bunch of people about it. And so fast forward to three years, I just went to Grant, that's 10X Growth Conference. I went with Christian because now we are partnered. I have a little bit more deals under my belt. And my biggest takeaway was that a lot of the super successful, 100 million plus, billionaire plus people have very similar principles that we do. We're in a service business. We start with profitability. We don't just jump into an idea if it's not profitable. One of Grant's big things, and he's talked about this again and again and again, is you start with a little bit of profitability and then you ramp it up. You don't just throw all of your time and attention into something that doesn't make money. The time it takes between an idea and profitability determines if it's gonna go well. And so a lot of these principles that they shared on stage resonated with the way that Christian and I operate our business. And it's been really cool to be able to see how it's transitioned from three years ago, him saying it's not gonna be scalable, to doing what he did and being able to absolutely scale it. So whether you like the guy or hate him, the stuff does work. That's it for today's video, but thanks for sticking it in and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time.